Right now we're talking about the accounting cycle and all the steps that occur on the way to issuing financial statements. So the first of which is analyzing transactions. Now a lot of transactions occur on a day-to-day -day basis in a business. Expenses coming in uh, in the form of invoices, sales receipts, loan documents, um, terms that you may give a customer or terms that a vendor gives you. So we're going to be compiling those, analyzing them, and classifying them into the appropriate you know, categories. And from those classifications, we should be able to create journal entries. And now we're adding those transactions to a journal. So after we have those journal entries created, now we're moving on to posting those journal entries to a ledger. And now a ledger is really just a summary of all those accounts. So after, we're going to create a trial balance. Now what a trial balance is, is it's really making sure all our debits and our credits for all the accounts equal one another. So again, do our debits and credits balance? And they should. So after our trial balance, we're going to record adjusting journal entries. So at the end of each period, these adjustments are necessary because we may use up supplies. Um, we may have depreciation that occurred that we need to account for. Um, there may be loan interest that we haven't accounted for yet um, that occurred during that period. So these are the adjusting journal entries that are, that are going to happen. And again, we're going to run an adjusted trial balance. Once again, we made entries. So we're going to make sure that all our debits and credits are still in balance. And from here, we can prepare our financial statements. Now, that's technically not the last step. There is one more after this, and that is prepare our closing entries. And And this is going to be where we close out our temporary accounts. So our revenues, our expenses, our dividends are going to be closed into retained earnings and closed out for that period. Now, after those closing entries are made, our final step, and you may have guessed it but based on the previous steps, we can do a post-closing trial balance. because we made entries. So it's always a good idea after you make entries to make sure that your debits and your credits for your accounts all balance.